Hey, click on Detroit and Facebook. I'm Lauren Podell hanging out with you on the weekend here in the beautiful downtown Royal Oak. If there's one thing you know about this city, you know there are parking meters everywhere. But this weekend, these parking meters are being made a little more beautiful. Why? It's all a big kickoff to Arts Beats and Eats. I'll have to do a few coats to try and get fine lines. Meet Francesca Galliano of Royal Oak, a mom, a wife, and fine artist who's bringing her talents to the streets of her hometown, all to kick off a festival we all know and love. To have public art, and for this to even kind of be an introduction to the Arts, Beats, and Eats weekend, where you see these live artists, it starts getting the energy going and people excited. And she's one of 50 local artists, you heard me, 50 who gathered their paint, their supplies, and brought all of their stuff to Washington Avenue in downtown Royal Oak. Their canvas? Parking meters. This is the 19th year of Ford Arts, Beats and Eats, and we always try to come up with something new, and it can be really difficult. And one of our uh, staff members was kind of researching for a new program and came across something that another community had done uh, in the Midwest. and. Uh, we decided to call it Meters Made Beautiful, and so we had an application process, and uh, we have about 75 meters in downtown Royal Oak that are going to be painted today in a variety of designs and colors, and we have artists from all over Metro Detroit uh, here being a part of this really cool project. It's, it's interesting to work with. I've never worked on metal before, and so we've had to use Rust-Oleum enamel paint. We could kind of see, I just have this in paint thinner, and so it's a little bit loose. painting all of the meters on Washington from about 4th Street down to Lincoln and then we have a block on 4th as well from Lafayette to Washington. And then we partnered with the Royal Oak Commission for the Arts so we'll have some jurying going on during the festival and we will be awarding prizes afterward for, for the meters so that's exciting too. Sometimes you know we're in such a rush and parking meters um, are, are part of that rush. Like we need to get somewhere on time or we have to feed the parking meter. But it's just to kind of freeze a moment of time to, to kind of uh, forget where you need to go for a second. And